Thank you, Papa, for the avenue of wonders without number. I want to thank God for what he did for me in my place of work. This month, I got a double payment. I give God the glory for this, for his wonderfulness in my life. He has been blessing me. He has been blessing me all around, even where mm, I don't deserve help. But God rendered help. Thank you, Jesus. My time has come. My name is Aeno Exibirako from Cameroon, precisely in Manfe. Well, I want to thank God for his marvelous doing in our life. Since we joined the family of Wonder with the number, things have turned around in our life, and God has been doing marvelous things. Papa, I just want to thank you for God. You align yourself that God should use you to reach the world. May God continue to bless you more strength you are able. Since we joined the family of Wonder with the number last year, things have turned around. Therefore, it was difficult for us to eat. It was difficult money to come in and go out. Sickness here and there. But since we joined this Wonder Water number, my God, I can't even say it all. Things have been wonderful. I want to just testify. I have a bike of my own now. Before, I was struggling with an old bike, giving me one problem here and there. But God has blessed us since we joined this platform. May God continue to bless you, man of God, for giving yourself as a sacrifice. May God continue to bless you and your family. My time has come. Hello, I am Obi Musa Obale from Cameroon, but now I am in Argentina. I'm giving this testimony on the Wanda, Wanda Sudan Number platform just to thank God because ever since I joined this platform in March, my prayer life has increased and I've become more conscious of God. Every morning I get up to pray with Papa. It's automatic. But at first, I couldn't even pray for two minutes. I said two minutes, I couldn't even pray for two minutes. And two minutes was too much for me to pray. I never had the, uh, the desire, I never had the, even the, 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 the willingness to pray. But now I have the willingness to pray. I have that desire to pray. And so I want to give thanks. And I also want to use this opportunity to also thank God for giving me a visa to Argentina because for some years now, I have been searching for a way to travel. I have been to the U.S. Embassy two times and they refused me a visa. I've been to the Canadian Embassy and they refused me a visa. And now I now I got a visa praying with this platform. I was praying with this platform. Anytime I pray to this platform, I always put my documents, the documents that were recover for the visa application. And, and miraculously, I was given a miracle visa to Argentina. And now I am in Argentina and believing God for a miracle documentation, for a miracle residency. So I want to testify. I want to thank God for giving me a miracle visa and I know my miracle documentation. My life was a mess. It was a mess. I never had any future. It just even prayers. I never saw any future, but now I can pray. I pray. I can pray for us. I'm so, I'm so glad. Thank you. My time has come. My name is Catherine Mwale, testifying from Zambia, Lusaka. I've come to testify to the God of Wonders Without Number. I joined Wonders Without Number last year, 2022, in February. I got connected when I was praying with Papa. I, I had a dream some time back that someone has clicked something on my left breast and that same thing was growing inside and it was clicking inside to the heart. So I started praying with Papa. And then when we were praying, Papa located me saying, I can see there's a woman who has an affliction that af of, you are failing to breathe. That affliction, it's gone and you are free in Jesus' name. Since then, I, I got connected and then from there, I became free. 
I continued praying with Papa. I've been praying and uh, I've grown spiritually. I'm no longer the same. I can wake up to pray at midnight. I can pray at any time. I can read the Bible. I have even become an evangelist to evangelize the word of God through this same program of Wonders Without Number. I've learned a lot on this program. I've learned and I'm a follower of Celebration TV because of Wonders Without Number. My life is no longer the same. Thank you so much, Papa, that I have been connected to Wonders Without Number. More grace to you, Papa. More grace and more revelations because my life is no longer the same. My family has changed because of these same wonders without number. Thank you so much. I want to thank God for the self-delivery. I sent a prayer request on self-delivery and also I called the call center representative answered and prayed for me. Uh, that was a day before I go for the procedure. I want to thank God. This year's procedure went well and here is my evidence and I'm recovered very well. And again, I want to thank God for a new job offer I've just received. I received the call two weeks after delivery. I've always been believing God for a new job. And whenever Papa says that um, receive your new job, receive your pay rise, I've always been believing God and saying amen for that. And today I'm just celebrating the new job offer I've received. This company had rejected me two years ago, but they've given me a job I never applied for. And uh, I'm just so overwhelmed and I want to thank God. And Wonders Without Number finally has been a blessing to me. I've grown spiritually. I've grown to love God. I've grown to fall in love with scripture and also get my prayer points from the scriptures. It's just been a blessing to me and I want to thank God for that. Thank you. Life! Thirty-one years. Thirty-one years. This is the first time. Thirty-one years. She's walking. Thirty-one years. Two babies, not just one. That's what it is. He was blind. My name is Kuzo and I am from South Africa and I've been part of Wonders Without Numbers since two years ago, a month after it started. And there's a lot of testimonies that I can share, but if there's one thing that I hold dear, that I have learned from Wonders Without Numbers, is that I know what to do. I used to be a very weak Christian, crying about every challenging situation I came across. And since I joined Wonders Without Numbers, I don't cry, oh, I butcher the enemy. I fight back. If the enemy sends arrows, I send arrows back. If he tries tricks, I bulldoze him back. You know, recently I was in a very challenging situation. That situation was threatening my destiny. And the old me will just cry about it. But since I joined Wonders Without Numbers, I knew with scriptures to draw out, to pray about the situation. And I came out victorious. And I just want to thank God for this platform because I'm no longer this weak Christian who's always crying about situations, but I'm a warrior now. I'm a fighter now. Two years that I've seen my life grow. I've seen my prayer life grow. I've seen so many changes in my life by just joining in every single day. And I just want to thank you, Apostle Papa Johnson Suleiman, for being a man of God, a restoration apostle, for praying with us, and even your team in the background. Thank you guys for making sure that you pray along. And um, to the whole family of Wonders Without Numbers. My name is Oton Chipara. I'm a Zimbabwean staying in South Africa. 
My testimony goes like this. I have been working for this company for the past seven years. And every time I've been looking for a job, applying every time. But to no success or I'll just be cold and then it just dies down. But in February 2023, when I started, uh, when I joined the Wonders Without Number platform of prayer, I continued to apply. I got called for a job interview. And as usual, I just thought maybe it's one of those recruiters that normally phone me. It amounts to nothing. And the next thing, she says, these people are interested in my CV. In my CV. They would want to see me. I should come for an interview. I went for a first interview. I was interviewed. Then they said they want to see me for the second interview. I went again for the second interview. Then they said they wanted to see me for the third interview. I went again for that interview, and in all those interview views, uh, they were happy with my success, and they said they wanted to, and they said they would get back to me, which they did, and every time when we would pray and would say, receive a new job, receive a pay increase, I just continue to pray, even in this new job, that uh, I need to have a salary increase because the other recruiter told me that these people are not willing to increase their budget in terms of salary. But I continue to declare as it declared. When the position finally came, uh, lo and behold, the amount had been increased by half of the salary that they had already offered. So they said uh, it was one and a half of what they had uh, initially offered, multiplied by one and a half. And I thank God for for the grace uh, that has touched me through the ministry and also my prayer life has increased tremendously. I love to pray. I enjoy the things of God. My mind is always on the things of God. We want to thank God of Wonders Without Numbers. Ever since we joined Wonders Without Numbers last year in May, our lives have changed for good. Just after a month that we, we joined Wonders Without Numbers, I got a job as a caregiver. And I also want to thank God for Miracle Money. Miracle Money is real. We have been receiving Miracle Money. Our business was dead. No customer was coming. But ever since we joined Wonders Without Numbers, we have seen mighty testimonies in our lives customers are coming even customers that we forgot about them they can call us now we can get even referrals we also want to thank god that um this year in in february we bought a wi-fi because we were struggling with our data every time so we decided that we are going to buy a wi-fi and we are going to subscribe a wi-fi so in the month of march we didn't have money to to to, to pay so normally if you don't pay they cut you off immediately when you couldn't pay you are still on and i even logged into our account to see how much we owe them but in our account, it says that we've already paid on the 24th of March, which we did not pay. We want to thank God. Even our prayer life has changed. I can now speak in tongues. Thank you, Jesus. Our time yeah, has come. Um, we want to thank you, Lord, yeah. for this is the work of the Lord. Thank you so much. My name is Dr. Moyo Mbongeni. I'm a medical practitioner based in Johannesburg, South Africa. In the year 2000, I was diagnosed with diabetes mellitus. Uh, type 1, commenced treatment, uh, insulin, twice daily. And then in the year 2015, diabetes complicated with, to renal impair, with uh, renal impairment. Also in that year, I was diagnosed with hypertension. So a combination of both hypertension and diabetes uh, progressing rapidly with renal failure. And then two years ago, I developed uh, heart failure as well. There's a complication of both conditions. Physicians, my physicians, nephrologists and cardiologists put me on treatment, but um, I wasn't getting any relief. And then in the year 2022, yes, uh, towards the end of the year 2022, uh, my wife discovered Wonders Without Numbers. I think she was directed by a friend to the channel. And then uh, together we've been uh, participating in the morning prayers and uh, every day I put my hand on my chest because that's where the symptoms uh, were most. Uh, and to my surprise, the symptoms resolve. I can walk freely now. I can move long distances, something that I couldn't do. To the surprise even of my physicians, because we thought the condition was going to be progressive until it got to, end, to the end stage. Thank you to the God of Wonders Without Numbers. My time has come. Life! Yes! Yeah.
for 31 years. 31 years. This is the first 31 time. 31 years. She's walking. 31 years. Two babies, not just sweat. He was blind. He Papa, my name is Shinonye Williams, and here is my beautiful daughter Amara Williams. We are here to give glory to the name of the Lord for the testimonies He has put in our mouth. If not for the Lord, we would not have been alive in the land of the living. First of all, let me thank God who has brought up this platform. Wonders without number. I was looking for a prayer partner, seriously. Boom, and God brought Papa. We want to thank God. And um, I want to especially thank God who gave me a second chance. During the time of her delivery, it was something else. It was something else. After delivery, uh, I started having bleeding. I had to be operated upon. I just want to thank God for the grace to be alive in the land of the living. And to his name alone, I say, may all glory be unto. I also want to thank Papa who has brought up himself to serve, who God has been using to bless the life of millions. And we pray that the grace upon his life will never dry. Thank you, Jesus. Our time has come. My name is Mimi from America. I am grateful for God and for using Papa to pray for us on Wonders Without Number. I am I'm grateful for grace that God has placed on pop, upon Papa. And mommy, thank you for supporting Papa also. Papa, this is the miracle child that God has given me through wonders without number. Each my husband and I were trying to conceive. Each time we, we try to conceive, the baby would die. Two babies die. And it was a witch behind behind that. One day I, I was scrolling on Facebook, then I saw Wonders Without Number. So I connect myself with it. And ever since I connect to Wonders Without Numbers, this is the result of it. I, I had my baby, bouncy baby boy, through Wonders Without Number, through the prayers of, uh, of Papa. And when I was pregnant, Papa showed up in my sleep, telling me that this baby you are carrying, this baby is okay. And after I had the baby, Papa showed up again, showing me. The, the one that was killing my baby. It was my ex-husband mom. Papa showed me her clear. Papa told me what, why she was doing it. Because Papa says because of her son. She was fighting for her son. But no one was behind her son. No one was doing anything to her son. She just wanted to be wicked because she's a witch. And I am grateful for God to use Papa to bless me with this, with this um, bouncy baby boy. Papa, may God bless, may God continue to bless you and your family. In Jesus' name, amen. I'm called Mercy Asik Tambe from the USA. I want to thank God for saving my life, for saving my son and my husband. I want to also thank God for preserving my family and for blessing me immensely. Since I joined the platform Pray Wonders Without Number, my life has changed. I want to thank God for this testimony that was yesterday, May 3rd, during the Wonders Without Numbers uh, session at when Papa was in Portland, Oregon. That was at 11, 11 in, in the US it was 11 p.m. So, and I'm here in the USA, so I connected to the I connected to the platform. I connect every time actually. So this yesterday, May 3rd. Uh, 2023 why papa was ministering and he was praying as we were praying so i started speeding out things started speeding out things and i had to i was vomiting and trembling like 
I was vomiting and trembling. And also, one thing I noticed later on was when we were saying the amens after applying the anointing oil, that Papa, that um, the anointing oil, because he said we should bring out the anointing oil and he blessed it. So I applied it. Like, by the time I wanted to like say the like the last the amens the finishing my amens I I heard my son like you know crying he was yelling as well and all the rest and remember I was saying like I was experiencing my deliverance at that moment because I was on my knees I like, I don't I can't really realize when I went down to my knees because I was sitting on the couch so I well I fell down to my knees and I started vomiting I was spitting out spitting at some point I started vomiting it was like something was hooked up in my chest and. Since my name is Mercy, so Papa was ministering to a woman sitting down and at Portland, Oregon at that same time, and he was like, Mercy, Mercy, Mercy. When he called three times and said, and he was like, Good, see your deliverance, all of that. So, and I was like, He's calling my name. I don't know how come I was like, I so I really got connected and attached to that particular prophecy at that time, the administration at that moment, and that was how I received my deliverance. So I want to thank God. I want to thank the God of Apostle Johnson Suleiman for saving me, for preserving my life, that of my son, that of my husband. I know my family is whole again, and I know that things are changing for the better every day. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, wonders without number. My time has come. Life! For 31 years. 31 years. This is the first 31 years. She's walking 31 years. Dear Wonders Without Number Partners, we've got complaints about inconsistently monthly deductions and the frustration of repeatedly entering your card details. We appreciate your patience and we are here to make things better for you. In solving this problem, we are introducing PushPay as an additional payment option. This will enhance your giving experience, making it easier faster and more secured to use pushpay you have two options one visit the wonders without number website where you will find step by step instructions on how to set your giving through pushpay number two keep an eye on your email box for a simple guide from us that will walk you through the process thank you for your continued partnership and god bless you my time has come For 31 years. 31 years. This is the first time. 31 years. She's walking. 31 years. Amen. Believing God for a baby. Two babies. Not just one. That's what it is. He was blind. He God bless you. Welcome to Wonders Without Number. My time has come. Amen. 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 In the name of Jesus, your time has come. Amen. My time has come. It's called from the book of Psalm chapter 102 and verse 13. Thou shalt arise and have mercy upon Zion for the time to favor her. Yea, the set time is come. So when you say my time has come, you are calling for mercy and calling for favor. And in the name of Jesus Christ, these two elements, these two traits will be Come evident in your life. You begin to enjoy the mercy of God, the favor of God, the mercy of God, the favor of God, the mercy of God, and the hand of God be mighty upon your life in the name of Jesus. Amen. I speak great grace. I speak outstanding grace. I profess outstanding power, outstanding impact, outstanding miracles. Your faith in God will not fail. I decree the evidence of following God, the evidence of followership. May it gain expression in your life, in your family, in your life, in your family, in your life, in your family, in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. I, I decree today. You see, our life is built on loving the Lord. 
because God loves you. I just want you to know God loves you. He loves you so much. Don't be discouraged by the things happening in your life. It doesn't matter who doesn't like you in your family, who doesn't like you in your office. God loves you. He loves you. The Bible says in 1 John chapter 3, verse 1, Behold what manner of love the Father has bestowed upon us that we should be called the sons of God. What manner is indescribable, unfathomable? In Romans chapter 5, verse 8, he said, In that God commended his love towards us, that while we are yet sinners, Christ died for us. In John 15, 13, imagine the, 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 the expression of the love. Greater, nobody loves you like he does. So, you need to understand that and that gives you assurance. You can't be depressed when you know that. John chapter 13, the last phrase says, Having loved his own that is in the world, he loved them unto the end. That should give you encouragement. Don't be depressed. Don't feel like ending it all. Don't feel like, you don't give up. He loves you. First John 4, 19 says, We love him because he first loved us. He loves you so much. I want you to know, you are engraving the palms of his hand. You are special to him. When the devil tries to make you look around your situation, don't look around, look above. And tell the devil, I know God loves me. I know God loves And that's why I love him. That's why you love him. That's why we love you, Jesus. That's why we love you. We love you, we love you, we love you. Father, we thank you. We bless your name. We bless your name. We thank you, Lord. Glorify your name in all the earth. Glorify your name. Glorify your name. bless your name we love you we love you we love you we love you ah father we love you we say we love you because we know you love us you mean well for us you said through jeremiah and jeremiah 29 11 that you know the thoughts you have towards us you know the thoughts we are worried we don't know but you say you know and to give us an idea of what they are you in other words with the thoughts i have for you if you have an idea of them you'll be at peace is it is a, a, a thought and tension and plan and purposes for our peace not of evil you don't think evil of us to give us an expected end we are so sure both right in this world and the year after we will not get an expected end we have an expected end we love you help us to love you more 
Help us to love you more and more. Help us to love you. My faith looks up to thee. The Lamb of Calvary. Savior divine. Now hear me while I pray. Take all my sins away. Oh, let me from this day be holy. Oh, let me from this day be holy. And Holy Spirit, we welcome you. Holy Spirit, we welcome you. Come and move amongst us with your hope. If I had us, we lay aside our earth, the desires. Says Lord, Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, we welcome you. Holy Spirit, we welcome you. Come and move amongst us with your holy fire. As we lay aside our earth, the desires. Praise Lord, Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, we welcome you. Ah, somebody say, My time has come. My time has come. Say, My time has come. My time has come. If there is a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If you are watching by television, I want you to call somebody to get seated with us and tell the person it is time to pray. If you are watching online, touch the like button and begin to share the link. Share the link so somebody else can hear what God is doing and somebody can pray with us. A family member of yours who you know is going through some challenges and all, just tell them to pray. God answers prayer. God answers prayer. Psalm chapter 65, verse 2, thou that hearest prayer, unto thee shall all flesh come. God answers prayer. Luke 18 verse 1, he speaks a parable unto this end saying that men ought always to pray and not to faint. God answers prayer. In Luke 11 1, he said, teach us to pray even as John taught his disciples to pray. So God answers. I want you to overwhelm your life with prayer. So share the link right now. We are still in the month of October and we are on the team All Things Are Mine. All things are mine. I believe God that all things are yours. And I decree that uh, that prophetic word over your life. All things are yours. Your children, your spouse, your loved ones, your interests. In the name of Jesus, all things are yours. All things are yours. All things that pertain to life and to godliness are yours. Begin to receive them. Begin to receive them. Begin to receive them. Begin to receive them. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. That the hand of the Lord will be upon you. The hand of the Lord will rest upon you. The hand of the Lord will help you. The hand of the Lord will preserve you. The hand of the Lord will uphold you in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. We are see, see from scriptures. Don't forget what we do here is that we pray scriptures. We pray the word of God. And God has been so faithful and he answers our prayers. In Psalm 25 verse 2, read verse 1 and 2, he said, Unto thee, O God, who I lift up my soul. Verse to say oh my god i trust thee let me not be ashamed 
We're going to pray that prayer. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not. They that trust the Lord will not be ashamed. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. You will pray and tell God, let me not see shame because I trust in you. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. You will cry that to the Lord. You will sing that unto the Lord. You will say that unto the Lord. You declare that unto the Lord. You minister that unto the Lord. You say that unto the Lord over and over. Oh Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Lord, I trust in thee. You cry that to the Lord from your heart. That every element, every satanic trap, every satanic manoeuvre, maneuvering, onslaught, satanic deposit, satanic intention to make you see shame. As you declare your trust for God, the God of heaven will annihilate, exterminate. The God of heaven will destroy the root and the yoke of that shame, intended shame, in the name of Jesus. Amen. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Number one. Lord, Lord I, I trust, trust in thee. Let, let me not be ashamed. Shout again. Lord, Lord I, I trust, trust in thee. Let, let me not be ashamed. Not again. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Lord, I trust in thee. Let me not be ashamed. Ragada <laughs> Rabarete, 
Kaelo, Rosano, Kaela Nada, Sena Tabani, Kabela Diazano, Rabano Dina Zoye, Dira Duda Tabarude, Rata Bora Diazano, Sena Tabania, Rato Bada, Sena Bada de Bada, Sena Rosania Kalada, Sena Bada de Bada, Rato Bela Rados, Sena Dodia Baros, Rakia Tukana Zé, Shadovia Nakova, Zeroba Rushani, Cabrea Nama Lutaba, Zerosha Kira Kato Bé, Baraka Tosh, Baraka Mayezova, Baraka Mayezova, Baraki Borava Nayaka, Bareko Manina Brata Itaho, Bareka Mangos, Baraka Baka Tosai, Rako Barra Dade Akara, Zero Baruna Di Kapados, Zero Shadida Anna Kabe, Barra Dade Kara De Kede, Barra De Kede Kede Barra Di Kato, Barra De Kede Barra De Kayada, Zero Shabalade, Zero Shabara, Zero Shabade, Zero Shabadoka, Zero Shabade, Barra Kara Di Akama Hande, Zero Kara Di Akora. Para todos, sabe la fama de que, sabe para de nada, sabe para de nada, sabe para de nada, se usa a la atacada, para de nada, 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 sabe para de nada, se usa a la atacada, para de nada, para de nada, Sukada, Sakara, Shalete, Rako Parika, Toba, Rako Parakete, Sebilo Parakata, Rako Parika, Tosaba, Rakete, Tete, Rako Paradada, Tosa, Rako Shadira, Baite, Aguya, Seruba, Giza, Yango, Meka, Kerobe, Izoba, Radino, Radino, Shalom Davina Maro, Zera Dova Ikana, Maria da Frente, Rakova na Marito, Zero da Vinta, Zita Arma, Marito, Zera Cochisa Dos. In Jesus name, Amen. I say in Jesus name, Amen. You will not be ashamed. You will not be ashamed. So long you put your trust in the Almighty God, you will not be ashamed. In the name of Jesus, shame is not coming near you. Shame is not coming near your family. No trace of shame in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Instead of shame, God give you honor. God give you honor. I see a family being decorated with honor. I see a family being decorated with honor. Honor, honor. Honor comes to you. Honor comes to you. Pamela. I don't know who is Pamela. I hear that the Lord said to you, Pamela, honor is coming. Honor is coming. Honor is coming. Honor is coming in the name of Jesus. 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 Everywhere you have seen shame in your life. Anywhere you have seen disadvantage in your life. God is turning it to honor. He's turning it around for your sake. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. If there's a man to pray, there is a God to answer. He says, touch the like button. He says, let me not be ashamed. Psalm 25, still verse 2. And he said, let not mine enemies triumph over me. Let not my 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 enemies triumph over me. Over me, let not my enemies triumph over me. Let not my enemies. Ah, I decree as you hear the sound of my voice in your life and that of your children, your family. The enemies will not have the last say. The enemies will not have the last say. The enemy, you see, somebody say, How can you say you have enemies? Even God has enemies. Psalm 68, verse 1. Let God arise, let his enemies. Be scattered. Some people hate God. God Almighty is hated. Let them that hate him flee before him. Verse 2. As wax met before the fire. 
So let the enemies melt at the presence of our God. If God Almighty that created the, hell, the heavens and the earth has enemies, then you should know you will have enemies. We have to pray. Let not my enemies triumph. My father, my father, in the name of Jesus, as I begin to pray, let not my enemies triumph over me. 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 Say, my father, my father, my, my father, father, my father, father. shout it louder than that. My, my father, father, my father, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, Jesus. As, I begin to pray, as I begin to pray, let not my enemies, not my enemies, enemies, not my enemies triumph, triumph over me. My father, my father, in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. As I begin to pray. As I begin to pray. pray. Let not my enemies, let not my enemies, enemies triumph over me. Let, let, not me. let not my enemies triumph over 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 me. Rata, 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 Rata,
Jesus name we pray. Amen. I decree upon your life as you hear the sound of my voice. Wherever you hear my voice from, I make a declaration. So long you have put your trust in God, you will not be ashamed. So long you put your trust in God, your enemies will not triumph over you. I decree concerning your life, wherever your children are, the enemies will not have the last say over their life. God will preserve them. God will keep them. God will sustain them. I decree shame and mockery in your life is a thing of the past. Disgrace and disappointment in your life is a thing of the past. May God arise. May God arise in the name name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Somebody has had problem with the hair. You are a lady. You have to even cut the whole of your hair. Yet your head is on fire. It's like arrows are walking all over. Missiles. I command it now. Whatever it is. Stop! In the name of Jesus. May the hand of God be upon you. May that attack be over. 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 The Lord says I should pray for Reverend Benjamin. That name just came, Reverend Benjamin. You are in a, a, a situation now. You're almost giving up. Your marriage is affected. Your ministry is affected. Your health is getting affected. The Lord says I should tell you, He called you. He genuinely called you. And know this shall pass. Don't take any drastic decision. This shall pass. It's a phase. What you think you're about to lose, you won't lose it. And for your health, the Lord touch you. I rebuke the finger of wickedness. Mm. I see somebody being healed of growth. Growth is gone. If you are sick in body, put your left hand on that spot. Si vous êtes malade, and votre stretch the other hand. I command healing power. Je command la Skin la infection is gone. Les infections sont parties. Josephine, you have a problem with your skin. God has healed you. Have problem with your skin. Seven altars have been raised Seven for, been someone's ne for someone's ear Com never to work. But right now, your ear just popped open. Begin to hear. Those altars are set on fire. Ces sont mis au feu. I speak healing power. La puissance de la guérison. James Defiane. De James, James Defiane. James. There's a burning sensation right now in your chest. The Lord is healing you. 
pains in the rib is gone spinal cord affliction is gone God, someone is, is like your shoulder there's this weight on it your shoulder is even down people don't know why it's always down like that sometimes like you're carrying a heavy load on it let the bodies be lifted in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ I speak the hand of God upon you. Amen. The Seigneur sur vous. The healing power to touch you. Le sang de la guérison vous touche. In Jesus name. Dans Amen. Amen. Jesus. Amen. Let's take our offerings. The Lord bless you. He said you must not appear before the almighty God empty. Empty. You must not appear before the Lord empty. As you give to the Lord, may your heavens be open. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. All right. Good morning, Papa. Since I got to Europe, I have experienced rejection four times in getting my document. I had a dream. I was instructed to sow a seed to a specific amount. To the glory of God, I received my document after eight years in Europe. Thank you, Jesus. My time has come. God free from Italy. Good morning, Papa. I sent a prayer request to this platform concerning my son that was bedwetting. After I sent the prayer request to the glory of God, my son stopped bedwetting. Secondly, my husband has been complaining of pain at the back of his neck. It was so serious that he couldn't turn his, or raise his neck. We bought drugs to stop the pain. The drugs didn't work. I decided to apply the oil Papa blessed on the neck. To the glory of God, after we applied it, my husband was completely healed. Thank you, Jesus. Our time has come. Esther from Abuja. Somebody say, my time has come. My, my time, time has come. come. Good morning, Papa. My name is America from Lagos. My car alternator developed a problem. I bought a new one. After some days, it stopped working too. Due to financial constraint, I parked the car. I too, I too, I too decided to anoint the alternator one morning after the morning prayers. I left the car for some days. In fact, I forgot about it until the mechanic came to fix it. When he checked it, he said the alternator doesn't have an issue. I was shocked. The alternator is working fine. Thank you, Jesus. My time has come. Good morning, Papa. For the first seven years, for the past seven for seven years in Europe for seven years in Europe I had been fighting to get my document but they keep rejecting me I connected to the police platform trusting God to intervene to the glory of God I've been granted 10 years document I no longer have issue with document thank you Jesus my time has come Evelyn from France my name is Okafor for Livinus from Kano State Nigeria since we joined the wonders without number platform our prayer altar is on fire we have been enjoying miracle money. Secondly, we have been praying for land for the expansion of the church. But it's been fruitless. We connected to this platform. God gave us, gave us two plots of land beside the church. Thank you, Jesus. Our time has come. Good morning, Papa. My name is Emmanuel Pamadi from USA, Florida. I connected to the testimony of a lady in USA that got a work permit after connecting to this platform. When Papa was re reading our testimony, I shouted, I, Amen, I received mine too. To the glory of God, I received my work permit. Thank you, Jesus, my time has come. Good morning, Papa. My voltage regulator got spoiled. We had tried many times to fix it. Still, it didn't work. So we decided to take it to the repairer. After I connected to Wonders Without Number, I laid my hands on the regulator and called on God to fix it and left it for about four days. To the glory of God, when I took the regulator, lo and behold, it started working. Everyone in the house was surprised. Is surprised. Thank you, Jesus. Our time has come. Clifford Nanji from Cameroon. Good morning, Papa. I want to thank God for restoring my son's iPad. It got spoiled a month ago. I took it to the repairer. He told me Amazon, Amazon iPad cannot be fixed when it's spoiled. I brought it home. My kids started playing with it as a toy. <laughs> I connected to that testimony and applied the oil Papa bless on the iPad and connected to charger, connected to charger to charge. To my surprise, my son showed me the next morning that his iPad is working. Thank you, Jesus. My time has come. Queen from Canada. My name is Daniel Correa from Ghana. Before now, I find it difficult to pray. But since I became a member of Wonders Without Number family, I can now pray. Secondly, last week, I was coming back from the market. Something hit my right eye. I started feeling severe pain in my eye. At that point, I called on the God of Wonders Without Number to intervene immediately the pain stopped thank you jesus my time has come good morning papa my son wrote his wife final testimony and was greatly disturbed 
after writing fees in because it didn't finish answering the question it's supposed it was supposed to answer i decided to call the wonders without number call center a representative prayed with him to the glory of god when the result came he had b3 in physics thank you jesus our time has come in kechi from abia lord we give you all the glory in Jesus' name. Amen. I decree miracle money. I decree a lot. A pay rise where you work. I decree your passport. Your citizenship. I decree your permanent residence. Your green card. I decree your work permit. I decree your visas. I decree your appointment letters. Your promotion letters. In Jesus' name. Amen. God grant all your desires. In Jesus' name. Amen. Take advantage of the information on your screen. Call the toll free number now. Somebody is waiting to pray with you take advantage of every other information and reach out now and god bless you send me a video testimony today i want to see your face i want to see what god is doing i want to say father thank you for this lady thank you for this man thank you for this woman send me a mail a prayer request and let's see what god will do i'll see you tomorrow don't you forget this if there's a man to pray that is a god to answer. answer somebody say my time has come my time has come god bless you Dear Wonders Without Number Partners, We've got complaints about inconsistently monthly deductions and the frustration of repeatedly entering your card details. We appreciate your patience and we are here to make things better for you. In solving this problem, we are introducing Pushpay as an additional payment option. This will enhance your giving experience, making it easier, faster and more secured. To use Pushpay, you have two options. One. Visit the Wonders Without Number website where you will find step-by-step -step instructions on how to set your giving through Pushpay. Number two, keep an eye on your email box for a simple guide from us that will walk you through the process. Thank you for your continued partnership and God bless you. My time has come. Victory 2023 Florida. Wrapping up our America invasion as we come to Tallahassee. John chapter 5 verse 4, this is the victory that overcomes the world, even our faith. I need to pray for you for the spirit to finish because you can start where you stop. You start something, you stop. Correct, sir. Okay, let me tell you. People will like you when they see you. They see you, they like you. But when it's time to favor you, is a problem. I saw a place. You lecture there. They didn't pay you. Very true. Jumbo Kayanta University. Yes. yes, yes. Be my guest in Tallahassee for a move of God that never seen before. God's hand will be touching people. There's another miracle here. Tell me. For three years, he had been afflicted on this leg. He could not stand. But after you prayed, he stood up. He walked from here all the way to the back to ease himself. So if you live in America, you live in anywhere in the United States of America, North America, South America, anywhere in America. Be my guest in Florida. Be my guest in Tallahassee. Ministering Testimony Jagger. If I do like this, I tell you some praise God. Date 17th and 18 October 2023. Time 9 a.m. and 6 p.m. EDT. Venue Tallahassee Automobile Museum 6800 Mahan Drive, Tallahassee FL 32308. For inquiries, please call the following numbers. And to be part of a local organizing committee, please call the following numbers as well. God said to tell you, your time has come. Your miracle is sure. Jonathan Suleiman is coming. Bidding City, Nigeria. Prepare for Victory 2023. Apostle Johnson Suleiman. Be my guest for three meetings, two days, one venue, one preacher. The spell over the people is broken. Miracles! Oh my Lord. <laughs> She was blind for three years. But now she can see. She can see. For one year, she has not been able to eat, has not been able to drink water, has been stooling for one year. First and second November 2023 by 7 a.m. and 3 p.m. daily. You had one friend that yes, used sir. to tell all your problems. Yes, sir. Her name is Fumi. Your friend was talking to that man. And before you knew it, your friend now married him. Your husband said you have no child. God got angry with both of them. God closed her womb. One year, two years. Three years, 
four years. As I'm talking now, she has packed a load and ran. Happening at Omega Fire Ministries, Benin Regional Headquarters, Plot 24 Waik Road, at Duawa Benin City, Edo State, Nigeria. For inquiries, please call. Tell them the Restoration Apostle is coming to town. Rejoice, this is victory. He sent his word and healed them from the affliction. El Espíritu Santo Zaki. The Holy Ghost is here. El Espíritu Santo Zaki. The Holy Ghost is here. El Espíritu Santo Zaki. The Holy Ghost is here. And miracle power. She was carried here. They carried her here. Whose crutches is that one there? Victory 2023 Mexico. Fire. 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 Date 7 and 8 November 2023, happening at Mundo Nuevo, Matamoros, Tamaulipas, Mexico. The time is 9 a.m. and 6 p.m. daily. Be my guest this November as I come to Mexico. Journey into the realms of divine revelations and transformation with the captivating TV program, Apostolic Buck Shelf. From various corners of the world, amazing pastors will host this exciting series, delving deep into the inspiring works of the renowned Apostle Johnson Sulman, and cover hidden treasures, ignite your spiritual fire, and be empowered to impact your world. Don't miss a single episode of Apostolic Buckshelf. Tune in every Thursday and Saturday at the following local times. Thursday, 7.30 p.m. West Africa Time, 7 o'clock Eastern Daylight Time for viewers in America, 8.30 p.m. Central European Summer Time for viewers in Europe, 7.30 p.m. in British Summer Time for viewers in United Kingdom, and 9.30 p.m. Australian Eastern Standard Time for viewers in Australia. A repeat broadcast for viewers in West African countries will take place on Saturday at 7.30 p.m. 7 o'clock Eastern Daylight Time for viewers in America. 8.30 p.m. in Central European Summer Time for viewers in Europe. 7.30 p.m. in British Summer Time for viewers in United Kingdom. And 9.30 p.m. Australian Eastern Standard Time for viewers in Australia. Download Celebration TV app on App Store and Play Store to watch via Celebration TV 247 streaming app from anywhere, anytime. Get ready to be inspired and transformed on the spiritual journey like never before. The 32 states of Mexico is about to witness a move of God like never before as we come to Mexico. Out! 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 Get out! Fire all over you! Fire! Mexico is your time to experience the move of God in power, grace, and outburst of salvation of souls. So, I want to ask you, how many do you want now? Two. Twins. Uh, twins? Twins. You believe God for twins and you are so serious. And the close of the twins is here. Yes, daddy. Go and bring and it. The apple. Hey! Victory 2023, Mexico. Apostle Johnson Suleiman. Date 7 and 8 November 2023. Time 9 a.m. and 6 p.m. daily. Happening at Avenue Pedro Cardenas, Amado Nervo, 87396, Heroica Matamoros, Tams, Mexico. For inquiries, please call from the USA, plus 1-956-295-5561. From Mexico, 011-52868-100932. There will be an outburst of souls harvest of souls and undeniable miracles that it shall be said this is the finger of god i'll see you in mexico in proverbs 18 verse 14 the bible says the spirit of a man will sustain his infirmity a broken spirit a wounded spirit who can bear ministry is full of challenges trials battles and all kinds of onslaughts but you only survive based on how built your spirit is how established and how developed your capacity is. As ministers of God, we move from place to place every week to preach the word of God, even in church. It is very important that you take a retrospect and have a retreat and feel yourself to overflow. You have no inner life, but you want outer manifestation. There is a great ministry, there's an outstanding ministry, but the problem is the price. On this vein, I will be inviting you right now to our 
October, ministers without blemish. It's a powerful time of refreshing in the presence of God. Paul said in Romans 1 11, I desire to come to you, but I might impact some spiritual gifts that you might be established. Spiritual gifts can be imparted, spiritual gifts can be transferred, and He helps you to be established in ministry. A fresh fire, a fresh fire right now. Be my guest today in our chair in Nigeria. If you're a pastor, you're a prophet, you're an apostle, you're an evangelist, you're a teacher, you're called into any ministry gift for this year's October minister without pledge. I know you say, oh, I could watch at home, I could watch online. That's good, that's fine. But there is nothing like being under the atmosphere of the Holy Spirit. And also be imparted, hands are laid on you. Be my guest. I can't wait to see you. Theme, Minister Without Blemish, date 25th through 28th, October 2023, by 8 a.m. and 3 p.m. daily. Venue, International Worship Center of Omega Fire Ministries, Kilometer 132, Benin, Okenia, Buja Expressway, Auchi, Edo State, Nigeria. For inquiries, please call. So blessed, highly favored Status changed, battles won I've got the victory you overcame This is my set time and I know I'll proclaim This is my season There is nothing that the devil can do about it Oh, ready to win when time has come Ready to win when time has come I'm a champion Christ did it all for me in victory Battles won, the time has come We are destined to win We are highly favored We are miracles, my time has come Stay!